Hello everyone, welcome to Chef Shelly's Kitchen. So as you can see, we have a guest. It's been a long while since we've had a guest and this is no stranger to you all and to Chef Shelly's Kitchen because this is Shelly's sister, Karen. Welcome to the show again. Thank you for having me. Yes, it's my pleasure. It's wonderful she comes to visit us at the beach and she's a beach bum just as I'm a beach bum. And so we get to hang out together. So she had this beautiful um, green dress on and I was like, oh, let me change my clothes. Let me change my clothes so we could be twins. So, <laughs> so today she actually was the inspiration for this particular episode um, because it's been quite a few years now I mean, I mean at least like five six years you yeah. came to me with this idea of how to cook corn on the cob so tell us a little bit about the history of uh, how we came up with this idea so basically what happened was my friend Terry, she always shares recipes and things like that. And so she shared this with um, a group of friends mm -hmm. of ours. And I thought it was a great idea. And so, of course, I had to share it with Chef Shelley. <laughs> yeah, and I was actually shocked to realize that I had not done a taping on this before. Um, and this happened because I was actually over at a neighbor's house, Sarah. Hi, Sarah. And she was, the kids were out um, taking, you know, they had shucked the corn and they were taking all the, the hairs out. And each kid had a, a corn that they were taking the hairs out on and i was like oh wow um and she was boiling it you know and i oh, said okay. oh here go look at this episode and i go searching chef shelly's youtube channel and it's not there and i realized oh my god i never did an episode on this so perfect timing so look guys this is so super simple what we're going to do is we're going to take this ear of corn we're going to pop it in the microwave for four minutes that's it and then we're going to come back. We'll put this on a um, cutting board. We'll take off the end and it basically slides right out. Mm -hmm. So it is usually pretty hot and you want to, you know, take it out fairly soon afterwards. Um, but, oh my God, it's just such a breeze. And part of the reason too, why the benefit of doing this, when you boil vegetables like cabbage or anything like this, you really kind of take out a lot of the nutrients. Mm -hmm. If you're cooking it in the hull, all of that stays right there together. So, sure. all right, we're going to put it in the micro microwave for four minutes and we will come back and show you the results. How does that sound? Sounds good. All right. All right, the microwave has just indicated that it's ready. So let's get it out. Notice I have my mitt on because as I shared before, it is going to be hot. You can actually see it. All right, so now what we're gonna do is, because it's so hot, I'm gonna make sure I put this down here. And I wanna cut this up far enough so that I don't have any of um, the back part, okay? So that's just what you wanna do. Just be very careful. You need definitely a sharp knife to get through it, like so. And there we have it. Okay, the next thing we wanna do is we want to take this and, and literally just try to pour it out. Look at this, look at this, look at this beautiful piece of art, work of art right there. <laughs> love it, love it. I see one little piece, but that's it. There's nothing else on there. That is beautiful. It's not overcooked. Mm -hmm. And then of course I love my little corn holes here. So I'll put these in the description in case um, you want them. And I just put one on the end, one on the other end, like so. And then certainly add your, um, if you want to have, oops, let me turn it this way. If you want to have butter or salt or pepper, what, else, what are the things you like on it? 
butter, salt, and pepper. pepper. Yeah. <laughs> so you can just put that on it and you're good to go. I've actually even seen kind of these little corn, um, corn on the cob trays, you know, mm -hmm. that you could actually take, probably melt some butter, put it in there, oh. and then you can turn it around. Now yes. that is pretty awesome. Yes. But um, see you those. see how wonderful this was? Again, four minutes on an ear of corn. Um, you saw how nicely it um, slid out, and the trick is holding it at the top part um, and cutting it at an appropriate place here. So there you have it. Um, this is going to go along with our dinner tonight. Yes. So pretty excited about that. So thank you all for tuning in. Um, if this is your first time seeing the Chef Shelly show, I come out with a recipe every other week. Something that's simple, delicious, and a healthier twist on, on a lot of things. Uh, if you haven't subscribed, just click that subscribe button there. And certainly, hey, if you thought, man, this is great, I'm going to try, give me a like, okay? That helps YouTube to know, hey, well, let's, help, let's make sure we promote this video. So thanks again. Any, any words you want to share? It's summer advice and cooking? Nice to be here. Everyone, make sure you put on your sunscreen when you go out yes. and just stay safe. That's beautiful. <laughs> All right. Thanks. Bye, everybody. Bye-bye.